Remember, John Rahm started at the 10th hole, which he birded. Here he is at 14 with another chance, the par 5. There you go. It's a good start for John Rahm, moving up the leaderboard nicely. Let's go to the other side of the course. John Rahm, who's already three under par, playing the 15th. Short par four, 15th. It's the head driver really close to the green. Not a good birdie look coming for John Ram. Birdie number four for John Ram. In the first six holes as well. The three time DP World Tour champion is on the move. So this is going to fly a bit. Can he keep the control when it lands on the green? Just snags a little bit of it off when the club enters the, that thick rough. Okay. It's got a great lie there and then the left hand side rough. A lot of people following John Ram, even though he's playing the opposite side of the golf course. This is all down. Right to left early and then left to right all the way down. Slacked a little bit of speed there down the slope to hold its line, but it's still a good shot from Rambo. Ram at the 16th. He has not dropped a shot so far today. This for par. And he remains bogey free. It's been an excellent start to the day for John Ram. Four under to turn things around after a disappointing opening round. John Rahm at the 17th. Yeah, an island green here. The pin is only six oh, on here, right in the middle. Go. That's a poor shot from Rahm. That's very rarely see him hit shots like that with his short iron. Rahm at the 17th. Can we produce a bit of... It's going to be a delicate one. Sand a little, I think, just a little different texture today after the rains. It must have been pounded down by the heavy rains. Jabby, grabby one. Front pin today and very tight to the water. This is a bogey part at 17 for John Rahm. First drop shot of the day. He's back to three under, which is four behind our leader, Tristan Lawrence. Well, on the wood chip, you never know what's going to happen out of it. Pinned very tight to the front left of the green. Oh, what's he going to do with this one? Risky. Did not play this hole well yesterday, oh. did he? But how about that, Ken? That was absolutely stunning. Frightening flag, particularly from the fairway, because it doesn't look like there's any green at all. There's a little bit of strip of water in front of it, a mound beyond. Oh, he's got a little smile on his face now. Impressive, wasn't it? For an eagle three. Remember, he dropped a shot yesterday. And after the bogey at 17 today, it is an immediate bounce back. And John Rahm, all of a sudden, is at five under par and only two off the lead. Chance for them both to get into the red, something that hasn't been an issue today, at least, for John Rahm to one, playing the course the other way around. Already five under par for his date. And I must come out a bit dead there for John Ram. John Ram for birdie on the first to move to six. Just doesn't quite have the legs. He had the read. I think this man is on today. Over to John Ram. At the second, the par five. Out with a fairway wood. Trying to make the most of this par five second. 
Now, don't worry, people. This is just a bit of casual water from the big rainfall overnight. Now, John Ryan on the second. He's taken relief from that casual water that just sits in front of him. He's got a lot of green. Sounded like a great strike. Oh, look at the quality of the weight he finds from there. There's a bit of a cheat code here. If you can just send it a little bit right, it would move right to left to the hole. It sounded like he came out from the rough. There you go. A little Ooh. cheat code activated. Thank you very much. What a shot, eh? That little pitch he played into the second was an absolute delightful shot. And this is exquisite as well. After that fine shot from the right hand side. Thank you, Rambo. It's solid. He's on he's on fire today, this man. Off to four we go with John Rahm for yet another birdie. He's come to play today. Yesterday was the only day that he's ever shot level par or more around this golf course in four attempts. Obviously didn't quite like that with the way he's playing today. Showing the course who's boss. It's been a solid perf performance from John Rahm this far. Today just everything has been right. And there's another opportunity on the fifth. Not quite to be seven under today, John Rahm. Be nice to pick one or two more up coming in. Rahm, long range, 60 feet or so. Yeah, he's left that a long way short, John. On six. Just needs a few more rolls. It was tracking again. Um. Yeah, well done, John. Now to the top half of John Rahm the seventh, his second at the par five. Yeah, it's a bit like hitting to an upturned walk, this seventh green, it tends to tip you off at all angles. John Rahm on seven, he can't land this on the green. So he's just back in the stance a little bit. He's just gonna bump this into the hill and roll it up there. He's got a little bit too much pace on that one. When it landed, it just started rolling so there was no bounce. And it had too much speed. There's still a chance for a birdie, though. Oh, did he hit it? Oh, no. I think he hit it delicately to turn, and he's completely baffled him the break. You would think the whole, the whole green generally slopes from front to back, so you'd expect it to turn to his right. John Rahm will finish up here at nine. Beautiful. Yesterday. Beauty, says uh, Adam is caddy, and it certainly is. Splits the fairway. Pretty much stiffed it yesterday here. It was a bit close up. Didn't half sound good shot on the chance of a birdie he's had dozens and dozens of opportunities today from uh, that sort of range inside that whoa a little tricky one here low sun you can see if there's any blemishes in Focusing. Yeah, he will be really, really angry with himself if this doesn't go in. Three. 
through the routine. This is for a round of 65. Ooh. Yeah. How does that go left? I circle the other way. The green's going this way. Well, well, well. That's almost a collector's item, isn't it? And especially the way he's played out there today. Thinking birdie when he stepped onto the green, but I'm afraid it's a three putt bogey for John Rahm to round out what was otherwise an excellent day. And instead of a 65, it's a 66. To watch another DP World Tour video, click here. And to subscribe, click here.